This makes me look like I have a problem. And I do. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Casey and you're watching The Chowdown. So back in the beginning of August, Halo Top announced that they were releasing seven new flavors. And since then, I've been on the hunt for these flavors and I haven't been able to find them until last week. So for those of you that don't know, Halo Top is a low calorie ice cream brand and they already have a ton of flavors maybe like 20 flavors, and they just came out with seven new flavors, so I'm going to try them today, and I'm very excited. It's also nine o'clock in the morning. Not the normal time to eat ice cream, but this is pretty much the only time I could film this video, so we're gonna roll with it. And you know what, it's gonna be great. It's Monday morning, what better way to start a week than to have some ice cream? All right, so I'm gonna start off just because this is the one I grabbed. I'm gonna start off with caramel macchiato, and this is 280 calories per pint. That is the key takeaway here. 280 calories per pint, not per serving. All right, so let's try caramel macchiato. So I'm guessing this is gonna be like coffee and caramel. Yep, pretty much to a T. That's amazing, mmm. That's really good, exactly what I was expecting with a title like Caramel Macchiato. Um, it has a coffee flavor, but it's not too strong of a coffee flavor. And then there's caramel swirl throughout. That's really good, I like coffee ice cream, so I really like this one. I'll give this an eight out of 10. Chocolate covered banana is the next flavor I'm going to try, and this is also 280 calories per pint. So it looks like it has a chocolate swirl. I'm guessing it's banana ice cream with a chocolate swirl. Smells like banana. Um, it's okay. The banana flavor tastes a little artificial and I just looked at the ingredients and I don't even see banana listed as an ingredient. So it's not real banana flavor. Um, it definitely has an artificial banana flavor and it's not very chocolatey. So I actually don't really like this one. <laughs> I give that like a five out of 10. Not my favorite. Next I'm gonna try Rainbow Swirl. This one has 240 calories per pint. I'm guessing this is gonna be like a sorbet. I'm hoping it's gonna be like a sorbet. Ooh, it's so pretty. Love that. Hmm, interesting. I like that. It still has dairy in it. It has cream in it. So it's not, I think sorbet has, doesn't have any dairy, but this does. It's like a cross between ice cream and sorbet, and it just has like fruity, a fruity flavor. I actually really like this. I like it better than the chocolate covered banana. And I think the um, purpley pink color is my favorite. I'll give this a seven out of 10. All right, I'm definitely saving my, the ones that I think I'm gonna like the best, I'm definitely saving for last. Next I'm gonna try mochi green tea. I definitely don't know about this one. Um, I don't know what mochi tastes like. Green tea ice cream, I don't know. It just sounds like it could be bad. <laughs> All right, so it kind of looks like mint chocolate chip. And actually, the container looks like they're mint chocolate chip. Oh, and I don't know if I mentioned, it has 320 calories per pint. So actually, this one has a little bit more calories per pint than the other ones that I've tried so far. Actually, it's not bad. It doesn't have like a strong flavor. It's a very subtle flavor. I guess it does remind me of green tea. So if you like green tea, I think you would really like this. It's actually kind of refreshing, but it's just not like a really strong flavor. It's just very light, which is fine. I like it. Um, probably not the flavor I would pick if I had to just get one of these. I don't think I'd pick this flavor. Uh, but I think if you like green tea, you'd like this. I'm gonna give this a six out of 10. Maybe a seven. Yeah, I'll give it a seven. I'm cheating here because this is actually not a new flavor. This is one of their old flavors. It's oatmeal cookie. Um, I haven't tried it yet, but I've heard of really good things about this flavor. 
Um, a lot of videos that I've watched on YouTube of people trying Halo Top, a lot of people say that this is their favorite flavor. So I figured I would try it along with this taste test. This one has 280 calories, which kind of seems to be the average. Let's see. Mmm. That is really good. That tastes just like an oatmeal cookie. Now I know why people like this so much. Like almost to a T, an oatmeal cookie. Like they crumbled up an oatmeal cookie and mixed it in with ice cream. It's really good. There's real pieces of oatmeal in here. So it gives it some texture and the flavor is just on point. Um, so even though this isn't a new flavor, I'm giving this a 10 out of 10. That's really good. Mainly because they got the flavor down to a T. It says oatmeal cookie and it tastes just like oatmeal cookie. So they did a good job on that one. All right, now I'm down to the three that I think I'm going to enjoy the most. So I'm really, really excited. Um, I'm gonna try, I'll do pancakes and waffles next. These are basically like $5 a pop. Um, but I do see a lot of um, coupons for these and they are on sale a lot. So if you don't wanna spend $5 on a pint, just wait until they're on sale. And also keep watching this video so you know what flavors to buy so you don't go buying flavors that you're not gonna like. Mm. So this is pancake and waffles. Um, yeah, and that's freaking delicious. Oh my goodness. Mmm, mm-hmm. Oh my gosh. It's like maple syrup flavor, but with like, it tastes like pancakes. No, it tastes like waffles. It tastes like both. That's so good. This is a 10 out of 10. Solid 10 out of 10. It sounds weird. Pancake and waffle ice cream sounds weird. It's delicious. I don't want to try another flavor. I just want to keep eating this one. So I'm really excited about these next two flavors, but they also have the most calories. Both of these have 360 calories per pint. I guess that's still pretty good compared to like some other ice cream brands, but definitely more than any of the other flavors that I've tried so far. And we have candy bar and Halo, or candy bar and Halo Top. Candy bar and cinnamon roll. And those both sound amazing. I think I'm gonna go with cinnamon roll first. I have high expectations for candy bar, so naturally that means I'm gonna be disappointed. Ooh, there's like, ooh, what is that? Some chunk, some sort of chunk. Oh God, my hands are freezing. <laughs> Oh my God, that is amazing. Oh my God. Dude, that is so good. Wow, they nailed this one. They nailed it. I don't know what these little bits are in here. They're like chewy pieces of something, but they legit taste like cinnamon roll and the ice cream tastes like cinnamon roll and it's just a party in my mouth and I'm just really happy right now. Halo Top, you did this, you did it. Holy moly. I thought pancake and waffles was good. Can I give this an 11 out of 10? Cause I am, I make my own rules, 11 out of 10. And then last but not least, we have candy bar. 360 calories per pint. That's good. Mmm, mm-hmm. That tastes like a Snickers bar. There's peanuts, there's chocolate. I'm pretty sure there's peanut butter. Maybe not. It's chocolate ice cream. It's good. It's definitely like candy bar flavor. I'll give it like an eight out of 10. It's just not like, wow. It's good. It can, you know, stand on its own. It gets the job done. But after cinnamon roll, nothing compares. So winner 
I didn't realize this was gonna be a contest, but the winner, obviously, is cinnamon roll. If you're only going to get one kind of Halo Tops new flavors, maybe even any of Halo Tops flavors, get the cinnamon roll. So, cinnamon roll, first place. Pancake and waffles, second place. Um, can I put oatmeal cookie in here, even though it's not a new flavor? That's in third place. I'd put caramel macchiato in fourth place. I'd put candy bar in fifth place. I'd put rainbow swirl in sixth place. Mochi green tea in seventh place. And chocolate covered banana is picking up the rear. This is the one that I just didn't like at all. Mochi green tea is fine, but like, why would you get mochi green tea when you can get cinnamon roll? And then rainbow swirl was good, but not like showstopper. Candy bar was good. Definitely was candy bar like. Caramel macchiato was like, had the flavor to a tea and same with oatmeal cookie. Those, that's why those two are really good. Pancakes and waffles, they have the flavor to the tea and it's freaking delicious. And then y'all know how I feel about cinnamon roll. So I think that's all I have for you today. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what your favorite Halo Top flavor is. It can be any of the new flavors or just any of their flavors in general. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel for more taste test videos and I'll see you next time. Bye.